Fair Go Rounders, welcome back to another episode of Fair Go Rounds. This time around, we have the Build a Figure Super Scroll, who came included in the Fantastic Four series. Never done this before, so it is the first to first. I already included the left leg because it took a lot of uh, power to get in there for some reason. It wasn't budging to get in there. As you can tell, my hands are red from just putting this leg inside. So this one went in actually fairly easily. I don't know why the left one did not. Um, so just take an account when building this figure. You might have to put a, a couple of brute strength in it, but that's the build a figure super scroll so far. Left leg, right leg. Uh, we'll get into details right here of the chest piece. Pretty much added on really nicely. And this figure comes with two left arms and two right arms. So we have these two left arms, the regular and then the effects, in which for these figures, of course, I like to put the effect pieces. They look way cooler, way better as you could tell. And then the right arms, same thing. You got the regular and then you got the effect piece, which is like the rock, Thing formation. Uh, I'm so glad these went in super easy. Unlike the, the the legs, the legs were a pain in the ass. But this is really cool. Hand effects really makes the figure stand out. And then he comes with two head pieces. So let me see which one I'm gonna add to it. This is a regular one. He looks like pissed off and serious. And the other one, he looks more evil. Yeah, I like this one better. Oh, let me show you up close first, the details on the head scans. Number one right here. Really nicely detailed head scan. A very serious look. Kind of looks like the Green Goblin. And then the more sinister, evil looking one, which to me is the one that's going hands on deck. Fairly easy, thank God. Amazing. Just how I like uh, figures to be easy, standing, just perfect. And then the Human Torch also comes with this flame piece, which I think it's for this figure. I guess you'd put it somewhere around like this. It's pretty cool as well. I don't think it goes on the other side. No, I can. But it definitely looks better on this side. And this one looks like it's more inflamed. So I'll definitely leave it on this side. Definitely a cool piece as well. So overall, a great Build-A-Figure piece. And this was a major reason why I ended up getting a whole brand new version of the Fantastic Four. Um, because I already had the originals. And as I said in all these videos, I like original characters and outfits better than more modern ones. But this one is really cool. He has the base, you know, on the body. But... For Hasbro at this price, it gets the job done. Overall, great looking, amazing figure. Double no joint to knees, thigh swivel, articulation there all around. On this one, double jointed arm. This one right here as well. So really just nice movements all around. Very easy to maneuver. Very easy to adjust. So I do end up recommending get this, uh, getting this build a figure, even though it's gonna cost you to get the whole set, but the whole set to me is amazing, especially Dr. Doom and She-Hulk. So with this, we wrap another episode up of uh, Fair Go Rounds. As I said earlier, hope you guys stay safe, stay tuned. 
and we'll be back at you shortly.